Congressman Bobby Scott gathered local health care professionals to mark the 14th anniversary of the Affordable Care Act. When former President Barack Obama signed the act into law, 50 million Americans were uninsured. Now 40 million are enrolled. Sarah Hammond spoke with one man who says having Medicaid protected him when he was in a car accident. Chester Williams is happy to be alive today. In 2019, he says an SUV hit him and sent him to the hospital. He was in the hospital bed for six months and six operations. He credits his Medicaid plan for bringing his hospital bill down from $138,000 to owing nothing. They didn't want to know that Affordable Care Act worked because it worked for me and I have the deceased. During a discussion with health care providers and Medicaid recipients, Congressman Bobby Scott touted the 14th anniversary of the Affordable Care Act, a move that since its inception has enrolled 40 million people. People tend to forget what life was like before the Affordable Care Act. When costs were going through the roof, uh, people were losing their insurance. CEO of the Southeastern Virginia Health System, Angela Futrell, says the ACA saved the people who were falling through the cracks and allows for much needed preventative care. For our clients, those who live at 100% of poverty or less, it has been life saving, life changing. The ACA is an issue Republicans have pushed back on for years, saying the federal government should not be so involved in the nation's health care system. In their latest move, the House Republican Study Committee's recent budget proposal takes aim at the law. Gaylene Knoyton says she's always pushed for Medicaid expansion in her role at Celebrate Healthcare. No one should be without insurance at all. More than half a million Virginians are enrolled in Medicaid, while another half a million remain uninsured. In Newport News, Sarah Hammond for 13 News Now.